everybody, Goldie here, and today we're taking a look at the newest character in WWE Champions, and it is the late brother of Roman Reigns, for those that did not know, Rosie, the superhero in training. Um, so if you watched the blog reveal, I did a little bit of gameplay on him. He has since been updated, so this preview is going to be with the updates. He is a Ruthless Aggression-focused trickster. Trainer ability got a boost. Um, it was originally capped at 2 MP for green, and Silence Gems do 50% more damage at 26k. They've moved that down to 21k, and at 26, they've increased the Silence Gem damage to 100%. Um, Tech Becky is very excited for that. And Noaya Mayavia Legacy Link. Gems do 25% more damage. The superheroes, any color moves that deal damage will deal 20% more damage. That is Hurricane Rosie and Super Stacy. And then the Hurricane and Rosie get their own separate tag link. Leech gems do 50% more damage. Ruthless Aggression, matching any color gems, charge moves of that color by one more move point. Just the one standard set of gear he does have a brand new plate i will show that at the end of the preview but for now let's take a look at a build he's got available at three starts the finisher with both traps finisher is the running discus leg drop 10 mp deal 169,085 damage make 20 trap gems into red gems and pin the opponent red one the swinging side slam 7 mp Deal 137,826 damage and make 15 random gems into trap gems. If broken by your opponent, deal the decrease the damage of all your opponent's gems by 20% for one turn. Pardon me. If broken by you, steal up to 75,000 health. That number has increased from about 44k to 75k. Now, Woods and Naka still don't work as trainers. So until that gets fixed, he's not going to be... Um, nearly as effective as he should on paper. Um, red 2, the Diving Leg Drop, 6 MP. Deal 133,833 damage, and she's a 5x1 area to make into Trap Gems. If broken by you, deal 75,000 damage and increase your purple MP by 10. If broken by your opponent, deal 75,000 damage and deal 268,000 bleed damage to your opponent for one turn. Again, that is where um, King Woods would definitely be beneficial. But until then, we are going to run Butch for Red MP, Jinder for three more traps. Um, Dakota is also an option if you have her at 26k. Two more traps, 50% more damage to your trap gems. You would use that in place of a red gem damage trainer. Uh, my shiny brand new six-star Zombie Bianca. Bless. Um, for three more red gems. And Hall of Fame Snoop for red gem damage. If you have Acro Dragon, that's the play. I do not have him. I'm still very far away. So until then, we use Snoop. Uh, for the belt, I'm using a, two sets of Fury 2s. Um, just a standard 5% gem damage boost on the belt. And the Twilight Ritual plate. Whenever you break three or more red gems, make seven blue gems into purple at the end of your turn that's just going to help us clean up the board a little bit and i haven't beat up on ivar in a hot minute so i think it's time i think it's time it's a bird it's a plane it's super rosy all right um so we need to break one of these trap gems for us to get the finisher loaded so i'm gonna just take a little free match there going to do the swinging side slam cut out a bunch of random traps and then the finisher i'm gonna go to one time speed for this for the for the finisher animation because it's it's really neat you ready for this power stance -lin 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 -lin. Wow! pow bang all sorts of automatopoeia superhero comic book sounds Back. 
That's a DJ sound, but still. Um, so 2.8. 2.8. Ta-da! All right. Let's show off the five-star move with this um, slight variation. So slight variation on that first build, uh, bringing in the five-star move for a bit of a more defensive play. Uh, five-star move is the bear hug, 8 MP submission, make 25 random submission gems, and do 141,615 damage for three turns while submission gems are on the gem board. Remaining turn into trap gems if broken by the opponent. Decrease the damage of all your opponent's gems by 20% for one turn. If broken by you, steal up to 75,000 health. So it's the same trap effects as the swinging side slam. Entourage for this. Butch for red MP. Bringing in Davy Boy for 35% more red gem damage. Again, maxed out Dakota for 50 Probably better here. I'm just going red gem damage focus if you have dragon. Um, use dragon. You could also do a super sub build if you want to go full defense. Um, Nikki Bella, Papa Maya via Zombie Brock. That would work as well. But poor Ivar is getting beat up on a lot. So I'm going to spare him that. So again, you need to um, put this in a spot where you can break at least one. Because that's how you're going to load up your purple moves. And then the finisher breaking the traps is going to load up the finisher itself as well. Bear hug. So 141 for three turns. If it was a four turn submission, I'd say use Hall of Fame Lawler as a coach and make it two turns. Not a fan of the one turn sub. It's just super risky. Um, but 35 on the reds. This will be decent. Let's just look at like a little sped up on the finisher. Power stance. I also love that he does the airplane art. It's like, it's a bird, it's a plane, it's Rosie. Well, it's actually a plane too, but you know. So 2.2, reduce the MP, a bit of a defensive build here. Let's, um, let's switch gears and go take a look at his leech gems. Next build we're going to take a look at is available at four star. It's the double yellow with purple two. Uh, yellow one is the sidewalk slam six MP deal 121,966 damage and choose a four by one area to make into pyro gems, which will modify all gems above it into leech gems of strength 75,000 when broken by you. Um, that value has been updated from about, um, I think it was 44. 44k, 41k, something like that. It's been it's been raised. Um, yellow 2, the Samoan Splash, 6 MP, deal 125,885 damage and make four pyro gems into purple gems. And purple 2, the Samoan Driver, 5 MP, deal 124,938 damage and make 25 leech gems into yellow gems. This is the build that the new plate is going to benefit. I will run it first without the plate and then I will run it with the plate using the same entourage. Uh, Kofi for yellow MP. Veer for 50% more leech gem damage. If you have your Veer at 6 star, um, you get 125. So keep that in mind. Um, Seth for 25 on the leech, and then I don't have Austin Theory. He would add an extra 100%. Um, so this is, um, this is kind of the floor in terms of what this build can do. Um, the ceiling, I feel like, is really high. I'm using Brawn instead for yellow gem damage. Um, for the belt for this, I've just brought in a superior tech plate. Whenever you break purple gems, make seven red into yellow at the end of your turn. Um, but the new Mark of a Hero plate is going to be the plate that makes this work um, really well. Choose a 4x1 to make the pirate gems. There's all sorts of purple gems at the bottom. We're going to wild card and I don't want that. So I'm putting them there. So take a look at our yellows. It's 24k. And this is... You thought the finisher was a good animation? This animation is Chef's Kiss. Samoan Splash, and check this out. My man got air. They gave him hops. He's kind of hung in midair for a bit. That was really cool. Very superhero-esque. 
Um, I don't have any yellow leech gems, so I can't see what that would actually do. But we're going to make 25 into leech. Good old Samoan driver. 33k it looked like. So 2.9. Close to 3 mil without the plate, so definitely an improvement from um, the blog reveal stream. And again, a maxed out Veer, Austin Theory, and the plate would make that a lot stronger. And then the tag link with Hurricane as well. So let's go toss on that new plate. So the new skill plate coming out this weekend with Rosie, the mark of a hero. Um, it is a basic plate, not an ultimate plate. Whenever you make six or more leech gems, increase your purple and yellow gem damage by 75% for one turn. So this should make these leeches. We hit like 2.9 without. Um, we should at least crack three mil with this. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, so 24 and 31. those there and then we gotta we gotta slow mo the Samoan splash dun, 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 pow love it love it if DJ doesn't bop that on his preview I'm gonna be big mad yeah I said it uh, so 33 and 43 these leech gems are doing 41 again maxed out veer theory would make that a lot stronger um, it doesn't buff the amount of health you leech. It's the gem damage itself. That was my cat. Um, 3.2. 3.2. My, my cat decided to hit the desk. That's what that was. Um, but 3.2 with the new plate. Not all that bad. Not all that bad. I think he definitely needs it. Uh, but that's a conversation for another day. Let's go talk about Faction Boss. Last thing I wanted to do is talk about a potential faction boss build with Rosie. He's got two trap moves and the six star move, the Samoan drop, seven MP, deal 113,805 damage, plus 75,000 bonus damage for every trap gem. That um, value was boosted as well. It was like 30 something. Um, but for faction boss, they like to boost trap gems every once in a while. If you wanted to use um, Jinder for three more traps, Dakota for two more and 50%, Dragon for one more and 50%. Um, that would be like your max value for 26 trap gems. And then the 50 from Dakota, the 50 from Dragon, so you're doing 150,000 bonus damage. Times 26 for the traps, you're going to hit about 1.95 mil um, before any faction boss boosts. So could be, could be a utility card down the line but that um that concludes our initial look at rosie again a focused ruthless aggression trickster trainer ability at 26k silence gems do 100 percent more damage green moves start with two more move points and noaya maya via legacy link gems do 25 percent more damage the superheroes that's rosie hurricane and super stacy any color moves that deal damage will deal 20 percent more damage the Hurricane and Rosie get a separate link. Leech gems do 50% more damage. And Ruthless Aggression, matching any color gems, charge moves of that color by one more move point. Just the one standard set of gear. And uh, love the comic book background that the dev team um, designed for Rosie. I think the look is really great. Um, let me know what you think of the changes to him. Um, cracking 3 mil against... I don't have six stars to preview against, unfortunately, but we did hit three. Um, so that's definitely an improvement. I think he needs the plate. He's probably going to need the tag link too. Um, there is a moment. It's not displaying because I don't currently possess it. However, however, uh, the superhero moment is being added. Um, it is Hurricane, Molly Holly, Nikki A.S.H., Rosie, and Super Stacy. In Faction Feuds, that's not what I want to do. That's what I want to do. Uh, moves that generate all color gems will create four more. Multiply gem strength increased by four. Leech gems do 400% more damage, so that will definitely benefit Rosie. Um, and Blast gems do 200% more damage. So that is... Um, that's that on Rosie. 
Let me know what you think in the comments of this video. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch. Be sure to like, share with your friends, and subscribe so you're notified when my next gameplay video comes out. Thank you again for watching, and thank you for being a friend.